Hello, hello. How's everybody doing today? Happy Thursday. Happy Lumberjack Day. <laughs> it is cold here today. It is, I think, a high of 40 today. And tonight is supposed to be 30 degrees. Burr, burr, burr is all I got to say. Is burr, burr, burr. I already have my foundation on. Today I used Velour, my Mineral Touch liquid foundation. <sighs> Dries to powder finish, and I also added some concealer to my foundation for extra coverage. Really good coverage. Dries to powder finish. Doesn't feel greasy or oily on the face. Um, today I created a quad again. I like creating my own palettes. You can get these on my website, and you can fill them up with any pressed shadow of your choice for $52. And today I'm going to use my Optimistic, my Ginger, my Discreet as base, and then I've got Cynical, which is kind of a teal green. All of them are mattes except my Optimistic. I love my Optimistic. Okay, let me try to find a brush. Here we go. Just your basic little brush here. And I'm gonna go all over the lid with that nude color discreet. Oh my gosh, the sun's coming out. Look quick. Seriously, it has been raining for days. And as you can see, that nude is nude, all right? And I'm just putting this on so I have a base, so all the colors will be easy to blend. Our pressed shadows are infused with primer, so there is no need to prime your lids, okay? No need. I had to turn the heat on today. Welcome to winter. All right, so I have the base all over my lid. So now I'm going to go in my crease area and I'm gonna do that with gingerly. And I'm just gonna use a blending brush. And I'm gonna tap into that warm nutmeg color. And I'm gonna just kinda tap here in the corner so I, to get rid of all the excess. And then I'm gonna kinda just drag it in the crease and above the lid. Just kind of blending it back and forth like a windshield wiper. Blending is very important. And that base color that I have on my lid just helps everything blend. Just back and forth. And try not to go all the way up because I'm going to pop some highlight up there. Just a nice warm fall look. And I'm barely tapping into this because these colors are so pigmented. It's better to put little by little on, then get too much on, and then have to blend it extra to get it all off. And then here in the outer corner, I just kind of go upward and out. Okay? Just like so. Just a little color, and if you want to make it just a little darker, you can. Start in the outer corner and just work your way up. All right, like so. I think this weekend it's supposed to be cold, 
but it's supposed to be sunny. So you can get out there and clean up the yard, go pick out a pumpkin, do some fun stuff. All right, so I have my gingerly above the lid blended out on the brow bone and the crease area, okay? So now I'm going to clean up my brush. All right, so now on the actual lid, I'm going to add my Optimistic. And it's an ivory shimmer. And I just want some brightness on the lid today. I don't want anything too fancy. See? Just popping it all over the lid. Kind of pressing it on. Get down by your lashes. And this stuff goes on really easy. And I just tapped my brush a little bit. And that's how much shimmer I've got. Okay. So, so far I just have gingerly and optimistic on my eyes. Now I want to pop a little color in the outer corner. And I thought this green, it's like a dark teal green. And I'm just going to pop a little of that right here in the outer corner. And I'm going to kind of come up on the brow bone a little bit. And I'm going to just kind of blend it. Just something a little extra. Looks a little woodsy. Like so. Tap, tap, tap. And then kind of on the outer corner of the lid. And kind of bring it up a little bit. And then kind of drag it, move it around. And if you need to clean your brush off a little bit, go right ahead. Get that excess off there so you can blend better. Just gently go back and forth until you get it blended the way you want it. And we're going to pop some of my highlight powder up there. I want a little darker on this side. See how pretty that is? Just using three colors. Okay. And then what I think I'm going to do is I am going to pop some highlight. Okay. Isn't that pretty? <clears throat> so now I'm going to go up under the brow area and I'm going to pop some of my pressed highlighting powder in the color iridescent. And I'm just going to soften it up. And then I'm going to come down here in the corner. Kind of brighten up the inner corner of my eye there. And 
like so. Twirl it around. I'm not sure where I got these little brushes, but they're really cute. Little brushes like this. They're just handy to pop in your makeup bag. But see? Isn't that pretty? And create your own fall look. Optimistic, gingerly, discreet, we used as a base, and then cynical in the outer corner. And then what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to pop in that cynical and I'm going to kind of come underneath the eye. Starting at the corner. And I'm going to use that as a liner. Start in the outer corner, come underneath. And if you wanted to, you can kind of darken it up here. Okay, and then smoke it out, kind of blend it. Like so. Soften it up. Okay. I like the way that looks. I like it. Nice fall look right there. All right. And I don't think I have a lot of fallout to clean up. So I think I'm just going to contour today and just uh, skip the highlight. All right. Today I am going to use my sculpting trio. And it's specifically for contouring. And... I'm going to dip into this darker brown color. And I'm going to start in the middle of my cheek. And I'm going to go up. Okay. Now I have bangs, so it really doesn't matter. But I'm going to come down the side of my face here. Thin it out. That's what we're doing. We're adding color and we're thinning. Thinning our face out is pretty much what we're doing. Under here, darken it up along the jawline there. Shorten my chin up a little bit there. And make sure you darken it up underneath because you don't want all of that very noticeable. And I'm going to thin out my nose. I'm going to come down the side. Like so. And then I'm going to come down the side. And then I'm going to get underneath here. All right. Okay. So now to blend all that out, I'm just going to use my powder concealer brush. And I'm just going to just kind of blend it into the hairline here. Make sure it's not... So harsh looking. Look at that wild hair. Good grief. So many things that you can use to contour on our website. We have the actual sculpting trio. 
we have bronzer, we have our duet highlight and concealer stick. Just so many things that you can use. And make sure you get it blended in really well. And kind of bring it into the ear. Into the hairline. Crazy hair. And then this little end here, I can blend out here. Thin out my nose. Like so. Shadow it up under here so that my nose appears thinner. Okay. See how nice that looks? Beautiful. Sculpting Trio. Look for it on my website. Okay, so now I'm going to pop some color on my cheeks using my pressed blush. And I just tap, tap, tap. Right on the apple of my cheek. And then I kind of bring it up. Just a little bit. Like so. Okay. Okie doke. And that has lasted me a year. I know it's hard to believe, but it's lasted me that long. So now I'm just going to pop into my setting powder, or I like to call it blending powder, because it helps you blend everything together and set your makeup at the same time and a little bit goes a long way okay <clears throat> setting powder and setting spray very important products if you want a long lasting look throughout the day all right so now I'm going to pop more of my highlighting powder, iridescent. I'm going to pop it under my eyes and kind of brighten it up under here. And it's not real overly shimmery. It's just right. So I like to use it to kind of brighten up where I want to highlight. Get up over the eyebrows so that when the light hits your face, it will light up. It will light right up. All kinds of good products. All kinds of good products. I'm really liking this palette. Only $52 on my website. You can design it any way you want. Once again, I use today Optimistic on my lid. After I applied Ginger Lee in the crease. Okay. And I use this discreet. It's a matte nude. I put that all over my lid all the way up to the brow before I started anything as a base. And then Cynical. I have that in the outer corner and underneath the eye. Nice little fall palette right here. Okay, so let's finish our eyes. And I think I'm just going to use my liner gel for my eyes because for some reason I can't find my black pencil. All right. So using an angle brush to start at the outer corner, come across. And then I like to kind of 
come up underneath in the waterline and then come across just short strokes and make sure you get down by your lash line And I like a thicker line. Okay. All right, like so. Got some drama going. Start in the outer corner. Work your way in. Come up under here. And then make sure you fill in down by your lash line. Because you don't want to see that shimmery, optimistic. Okay. Like so. And if you wanted, you could come down. I don't come all the way across. I just come down in the outer corner here. Like so. Okay, and darken it up. Like so, give myself maybe a little wing. I don't know. I don't like doing wings. It kind of looks like a blob in the there. I don't know what I got going on here. Here, I'm gonna make a big mess now. I'm gonna make a big mess. Easy fix. Get my smudger. I want to smudge. Kind of smudge it out in the corner here. Okay. All right. Good enough. Good enough. You can get this brush. I think Elf makes it. You can get it at Walmart. It's a little smudge eye sponge. If you want that smudgy look. Kind of soften it up. Get it down by your lashes. Darken it up. <laughs> All right. So now let's get some mascara on. And I always kind of get most of it off before applying because you really don't need a lot. I just like to make sure it's all combed through evenly. Always do that. Epic mascara. Really good mascara. I don't need to curl my lashes because this mascara has an ingredient in it that naturally makes them curl upward. I don't know what it is, 
We also have 3D fiber lashes if you're really into that thick false eyelash look. Our 3D fiber lashes are a two-step process. You put the black gel, like mascara, on your lashes, and then the dry fibers are in another tube. You pack them on your wand really good and put them on while the gel is still wet. And then you go over the top again with more of the gel because you want to seal in the fibers. And I'll tell you what, you do that a couple times and you won't need false eyelashes. But seriously, who needs false eyelashes? Look at those. Are you looking? I had nothing on my lashes before I started. Use our lash serum every day. Every day. I even use it on my brows. I've got thicker brows than I ever had. I went up above here with the pencil, but you can see I've got hair. Never had it before. Got it now. I'm not saying it's going to work for everybody, but it works for me. And I'm going to tell everybody. Lash Serum plus Epic Mascara. You can get it in waterproof. Equal thick, curled lashes. Seeing is believing. Epic Mascara, get it. It's $24 on my website. And you can join a subscription program so that you will never run out of your mascara ever again. Ever again. All right, what are we going to do for lip? I think I'm just going to do a nudie. Going to do a nudie lip. First, I got to find my favorite lipstick. Where is it at? I ordered some more. This is well to do. It's a little nude. I've got some... Got some lipstick on there from a past experience. And it's a nude. Shimmer. I like shimmers because I have a thin upper lip. And a shimmer in a pale color, I believe, makes your lips look fuller and not so thin. Good old lipstick. You can get three of any color for $50 on my website in a set. When you go to my website, you click the link, you click shop, and then um, if you want the kudos for this month, you click kudos. If you want things for your face, you click face, like highlighter, foundation, blush, sculpting, um, trio that I used to contour today. All of that. If you want eyes, like for your brows, liners, mascara, all the different shadows that we sell, choose eyes. But in any category, scroll all the way down once you click the category and you will see lip sets, eye sets, face sets, tool sets, okay? Get the things that come in a set because you're going to get more for your money. All right? So you would click lips and then scroll down to lip sets. All right? Good deal. Good, good deal. Okay. That's my look for today. I'm going to set it now with my setting spray so it stays on. refreshing. 
It's not sticky. It smells delicious. Good, good thing. Everything on my website is an awesome product. I have tried pretty much everything on there. There are some um, facial, like skincare products that I have not tried yet. But I'm telling you what, I stand by all of it. You're going to pay a little extra because they use real minerals in their mineral makeup. Okay? And all the ingredients are listed um, under the product. Okay? So we're not trying to hide anything and nothing's tested on animals okay so you can trust us trust us Christmas is coming we got all kinds of stocking stuffers for you um, our kudos would be a good stocking stuffer um, lipsticks we have our tinted lip balms um, you can buy those in a set that would be awesome or who wouldn't want an epic mascara in their stocking epic mascara good 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 product or look what we have look what we have we've got palettes already made for you we have five or six of them this is five seven shadows in each and you can buy them individually or you can buy three of these and these are big here's my hand three of these for $130 Yes. Who wouldn't want that? Okay. This is our neutral palette. This is palette one. But get on there. Get on there and see what we have to offer. We have splurge cream shadows, all kinds of colors. Okay. Um, three of them for $70. Let me just show you some of these colors. This is unapologetic. Look at that color. Who wouldn't want that color? awesome color unapologetic and our cream to shadows they turn to a powder they do not crease okay um, look at this color amused look at that beautiful color it's sea foam green isn't that pretty all kinds of different colors we've got browns we've got pinks we've got shimmers look at this elegant nude shimmer gorgeous 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 color um, rapturous. Look at that. Come in these frosted little glass jars so they'll keep. Um, assertive. Ooh, look at that dark green. Look at it. Look at it. Beautiful, beautiful colors. And this is Faithful. This is a brown. I use this on my brows sometimes. And ferocious. That pretty blue color. That pretty wouldn't that be pretty with a denim jacket? Maybe a little unapologetic in the crease. Put this on the lid. Pretty. Check it out. All kinds of products. All kinds of things going on on my website. And if you're interested in doing what I do, it's pretty good side gig. You could make it full time or you could make it side. I've been doing it for a year, and I'm not doing too bad, let me tell you. I've got a lot of people in town, they're aware of what unique is. When I first started last October, they're like, what's unique? Nobody around here knew what unique was. So I don't know what, I'm going to have to do something with my hair, good grief. But um, yeah, for $99, you can buy $310 worth of makeup, and you get a glorious Boss Bay bag. I think I got it right behind me. Where is it? Right there. That bag. Yeah. And then that bag back there, that black one with the gold chain, you'll get that when you buy a collection. There's six different collections, five or six different collections. You buy a collection. Who wouldn't want that for a Christmas present? That bag you can use as a handbag full of makeup products. I would love it. I would adore it. <laughs> All right. But if you're interested in, in presenting, it's $99. You get a free website. Okay. Um, you set up a business page on Facebook. I could help you do that if you needed help. Um, I would be your sponsor. And we could do this together. 
We could be a team. $99 and you can start your own business. All right. That's it for my Thursday look. Tomorrow's Friday. Hopefully I get time to get on here and do another video tomorrow. But until then, enjoy the sunshine because I think it's going to stay out. All right. Talk to you later. Bye.